Hi there, Hannah here for our drive. When we started our drive, we knew that there were endless real world applications, but we were unsure who would be the first to adopt it. Would it be lawyers wanting to save their legal documents immutably, or maybe grandparents wanting to preserve those adorable pictures of their grandkids? Well, we have had some professionals and some grandparents, but our earliest adopters have been NFT artists. They've uploaded files by the thousand because they know that our weave is the only place to store their art for forever. So today in this video, I want to show you how NFT artists are using our drive. Let's take the example of prominent crypto artist Stella Bell. Have a look at her most recent art on OpenSea. If I scroll down and scroll to the bottom of the description, you see that she lists both the Arweave download, which allows anybody to download the file permanently, as well as the Arweave view, which as well as allowing you to preview the file also gives you the transaction info. Now, our drive does not have native integration with OpenSea, so including both of these things is the best way to entangle your art file with the NFT listing on OpenSea. Other artists choose to put this information in the unlockable content section, which just means that only the owner of the NFT can see these two links. It's totally up to you how you want to use these links. Let's get started uploading your NFT to the PermaWeb using our drive. Now I'm assuming that you already have a wallet and a basic understanding of our drive. If you don't check out our other videos, which will get you started and come back and join us when you're ready. Now we want to make sure that we have a drive for our NFT. So if you don't have one, you already want to use, of course, we're going to want to start by going to our new button and clicking on new drive. I'm going to name mine Laserilla, and you can make your drive either public or private. Most NFT artists choose to make theirs public so that the art can be accessed without the need for a private key. I'm going to make mine public and go ahead and click create. And there it is. My drive is ready to go. Now to get my NFT in the drive, I treat it like I would any other file. I come back to my new button, click upload file, find my NFT on my computer. There's my little Tamarin, my laser eyed Tamarin and click open. Now our drive is going to do what it does every time that we upload a file, which is analyze the size of the file to determine how much it will cost to store that file. It's estimating it's gonna be less than a cent US for just to store my adorable little Tamarin on the PermaWeb. I'm good with that. I will go ahead and click upload. And there it is. My glorious NFT is now on the PermaWeb. Next, we want to get the links to add in our description on OpenSea. It's pretty simple. I'm going to just select my NFT and then to get the download link, we just come here to this share file. And when this pop up appears, we click copy link and that's it. Just like our weave, this URL never times out or expires and you can use it in your description on OpenSea. Now to get the Arweave view that we talked about earlier, you're going to come up here to preview and click on it. This will show you your NFT on the PermaWeb. I am going to copy this long link in my web browser and add that to OpenSea as well. Now here's a tip. Everything after this arweave.net forward slash you can use to look up details about your art file on the Arweave blockchain. Simply copy all of those letters and numbers, head on over to viewblock.io and click on the search result. This will take you to the details page. And this is your independent proof that your art file is saved on the PermaWeb. And that's it. Your NFT is now saved immutably on our weaves, permanent decentralized storage. We'd love to see our drive have native integration with OpenSea and other NFT platforms.
But until then, you can use this workaround to associate your NFT listing with a permanent copy of your art file on Arweave. That's not all. Our team is planning ways to create atomic NFTs on our drive that combine image files with metadata. And NFT creators have been running wild with our drive and our updated CLI. For example, electronic musician BT used our CLI on his sold out orbs project where he created custom private drives to create songs that play for forever without looping. It's so cool. So the possibilities with permanent storage are endless. If you have thousands or even millions of files to upload, our CLI offers developers many advanced tools for NFTs. And if you don't feel like doing any of this yourself, we also offer a valet service where we will upload your files for you or even create custom code to make sure that your files are saved just the way you want them to be. Visit rdrive.io slash valet to get started or reach out to us on Discord if you need any help exploring the possibilities of your NFT project. We look forward to seeing what you'll create.